Welcome, welcome to Hangman Tara Libra. We're going to get into your love reading for your month of February. We're going to find out all about your love stuff in just a moment, but please go ahead, hit subscribe, follow, share, and like do all the things that you need to do to get us into this reading. And to start, we're going to get into this real quick. All right, so I already pulled a little Oracle Energy card, just getting off of that, that almost like... Any instability here, it's almost like something has been filling your emptiness, okay? So there was an instability at one time energetically, and I'm getting that you have something that is filling that emptiness. So something that is just like overflowing, something you prepared for, something you worked really hard for, something that gives you a lot of pride and it makes you feel very abundant um, in all sorts of ways, physically, within God, within the universe, maybe just like in general, it makes you feel just like overly amazing. I don't know what that could specifically mean. I'm feeling like it could be like new home, new baby, new life, whatever that might mean. Maybe just beginning of, you know, uh, preparedness of pregnancy, whatever that means for you, please align wherever that goes. Um, let's see. What do we got? Love stuff. So there is some sort of, I don't know what, okay. All right. So there is some sort of a conflict or some sort of instability here. And I think the instability has to do with some sort of messages or lack of communication or just feeling as if like you're not coming across. It's like your communication isn't coming across to your person. Your person could be an air sign, could be an earth sign. Um, between the two of you, this lack of communication, this is all really coming from the fact that there could be a new baby, there could be new life. This could be just something that you've been working on, building towards, whatever that might mean. This creation or this connection, um, I feel like should bring you kind of whole. And that might be what, you know, that energy was talking about as far as like filling some sort of emptiness. And it was a lot of hard work. That could definitely mean some sort of a baby situation or pregnancy that came out. And you had this beautiful bundle of joy and it was filling up all sorts of every sort of cell in your body. Um, I do think that this new beginning is something that you wish that you would have prepared a little bit more for you and this specific person even. Maybe you feel unprepared. Maybe now there's like lack of communication or lack of some sort of support um, mentally. I feel like there's definitely some sort of, not heartache, but it's almost like the defensiveness kind of takes over um when 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 the mere fact is that you you just can't communicate anymore so there's just like a whole line of being defensive um going into the month of february what do we got going on as far as this person that you're dealing with there's definitely some sort of new life or new home or new abundance of something um new security i don't know what that means but Again, if it aligns with you, let it align. I do feel like there is some sort of um, kind of like taking some time to assess the situation, the passion here, and assessing, making sure that you move through it in the best way that you know how, especially if it brings you, I don't know, I feel like if it brought you any sort of purpose in life, especially if they added to, you know, the situation as far as you and the baby, um, or you in this new life, I think that this is definitely worth assessing, but it's something you're going to um, assess intuitively and you want to reflect on the situation because this person, this person is a damn, I don't know what this person is. This person is definitely in love with you, but they're very immature, okay? I feel like in the beginning, things were the highest of feelings. I feel like this person had a lot of happiness. Um, the two of you came together and there was a lot of intuitive kind of connection and it was very nurtured. Um, but this person again is emotionally a little bit more immature than you or you could be more immature than the other person either or it really disconnects the two of you. So by the ending of February, where do we have these two people? Okay, we're reverse. So I just feel like there's going to be some sort of um, kind of coming back together and just maybe just trying to start something new here because this person knows that you're the things that revolve around you. I mean, it's, it's his entire life, his entire world, her entire world, whatever that might mean. I feel like this person knows where 
their world lies and it's within you and around you. Um, so any new beginnings or new endings are always going to be with you. This person's going to really come forth and try to show you more happiness and nurture a little bit more feeling and add a little bit more um, magic to the relationship. So I feel like they're going to really push for that. I feel like a little bit of romance, hopefully. And I feel like they're going to come in with this, you know, pure intentions. They're being steered with pure intentions, especially pushing them behind them. I feel like processing the highest and lowest of feelings are going to happen with this person within a matter of weeks here. So you're, this is really coming together. Yeah, so they're definitely going to ask you to renew love with them. So you're going to assess the situation. Things, you know, you might have a weird communication with this person, but they're going to come back and be like, I've processed the high, the lows, and I'm here. I have pure intention. I want to renew. I want to restart. And I want to allow you to become my world again. And I want you to know this, okay? So I feel like if you just hang in there, this is going to happen. I feel like things are gonna come back and connect again. I think things got disconnected, especially if you have a new baby or new things that feel like a baby, this is going to feel very disconnected. So hopefully that communication and that, um, that offer to renew things will help out, especially in the ending of February, perfect timing. It's a month of lovers could not get any better. Hopefully this all comes together. I see roses. So hopefully that happens. All right. I'm going to get out of here. Please go ahead, hit share, like, and subscribe, and make sure that you share this with all of your family and friends, especially if you really enjoy this reading channel. So don't forget to tune in, subscribe, and check out all of your hangman tarot for your celebrity readings, love, and general. I will see you soon. Enjoy your month.